Just put a crow's foot on it. <laughs> so in my previous video, I made this custom tool to remove and install the coolant temperature sensor in a GM 3.6. A lot of people commented and said I just needed to use a crow's foot. I'm here to tell you, it's not that simple. Look closely. The engine block is counterboard where that sensor drops in. The hex of that sensor sits below the surface of the block and you can't even get a normal socket in there. You gotta grind the wall thickness really thin to fit in between the block and that sensor. The only crow's foot that comes close to working is this one made by Martin Gear and Sprocket. I didn't want to modify it. I was going to have to take the wall thickness down really thin to be able to fit around that sensor, so I decided I'll just make my own. Oh, and yeah, I tried the torque adapter on it. Not a chance. So I don't want to hear it. 